Hey, in today's episode, we're gonna to talk to you about five essential leadership skills for managers. Let's do this. Now, if you're like a lot of executives, you're always trying to improve your leadership skills. Good leadership skills result in happier team members, a more profitable business, and lower stress for you. So let's go through the five essential leadership <laughs> So let's go through the five essential leadership skills you need in order to be a better manager. Skill number one, great leaders understand that it's better to act than it is to react. Let's unpack this for a second. If you've ever played the game of chess, you realize that the person who wins the game of chess is the person who thinks more moves ahead. The same holds true in business. The more moves ahead you think, the better off you are because you're being proactive in what you're doing rather than reacting to the stimuli around you. So great leaders realize it's better to act and be proactive than it is to react and be reactive to what's going on. Skill number two, great leaders also understand that 80% of all problems can be solved by one thing. What's that one thing? Better communication. Now it sounds too good to be true, but studies show that 80% of all problems can be solved through better communication. Ideally, that's face-to-face, in-person communication. Sometimes in this day and age, it has to be done via Zoom. But by opening up channels of communication, 80% of the time, whatever problem your business is facing is gonna be solved just by doing that. Skill number three, great leaders realize that self-confidence is the result of action. That's a key concept I want you to think about. Confidence is not the result of pep talks or telling yourself you're wonderful. Confidence is the result of action, action that you've taken to move through challenges and to succeed on the other side. When you reflect back on those challenges and how you faced them and overcame them, that's what creates confidence. So pep talks are great, but the more important thing is to take action on things and overcome it and reflect back on the successes in your life. If you do that, you build self-confidence. Skill number four, right, four. Skill number four, great leaders understand that your choices are more important than your circumstances. When we all bump into problems along the way in our careers, when we all have the potholes that we have, your instinct sometimes can be to blame your circumstances. Well, this happened, that happened, these outside influences made all this happen. The reality is, is that great leaders understand it's the choices they make that lead to the outcomes that they want. So don't blame your circumstances, get over that. We all have circumstances. What I want you to do is go through and start making the right choices. And by making the right choices, you end up having more success than if you blame your circumstances on what your situation is. Skill number five, great leaders understand that humility is a source of power. Now, if you've ever noticed, the quietest person in the room is the one with the most success under their plate. The reason is, is because they know they don't have to brag. They know that if they let their actions speak, that will be more impactful than them talking about how great they are. So remember, humility is something that you should practice every day in order to be a great leader. The more humble you are, the more power you have in any given situation. Now, if you'd like to learn more about becoming an effective leader, check out this video here where we dive into this a little more deeply. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell so you'll be notified next time we do a segment like this. I'd also like to give a shout out to Rakafit Yakobi Fromm who left a great comment in one of our last videos. My name is Jamie Turner. This has been In 60 and I'll catch you next time.